What's up, you guys, and welcome back to another video. Oh my God, you guys. So this is a look that I'm gonna bring you guys today. I'm super excited, I'm super proud and happy at the way it turned out. I definitely stepped outside my comfort zone with this one, and I'm so, 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 so happy. Um, guys, if you guys are new here, I am Venus Delay. Please go ahead and consider subscribing to this channel if you guys like what you see, because I bring you guys videos every single week. And I have a really special announcement at the end of this video, so please stick around to the end of this video so you guys can know the special announcement. It's so you guys can know what the special announcement is. Yeah, it's super fun. So if you guys like to see how I got this look, please just chill out. I'll be right back. I was like, you know what? It's been a while since I showed you guys how I did my foundation base. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring you guys that today. Um, and before we go ahead and get started, give it a video a thumbs up, uh, subscribe to the channel, and I love you. Okay, let's get started. Let's go. I'm gonna go ahead and do is use my Milk Hydro Get Primer. It's like one of my favorite primers. I will either use this or the um, the Elf Hydrating Booster Drops, but um, this is my goodie. This is my this is the one. Put a few pumps on my hand. I'm gonna just go ahead and work that into my skin. I'm trying to work on not ODing with my primer because I always will go in. I'll just put like because it feels so good putting it on and it feels so good on the skin. That I kind of just want to like really get it on there, but it's like no Venus. You need to preserve your primer. All right, so now that we have our skin moisturized, we have our skin primed and prepped and ready to go, I'm gonna go ahead and use uh, my LA Girl Pro Foundation in the shade Dark Chocolate. This has been my go-to foundation. It's super inexpensive and it's very full coverage. Like, people be sleeping on this foundation. I mean, obviously there's like high-end foundations that are amazing and other uh, foundations that are great as well, but I mean, you need to budget these days. I mean, I've noticed I've been saving a lot more money because like, you know, this pandemic, we're all socially distancing and like sheltering in place, which we should be doing. And if you're out, you need to be wearing a mask. But for the most part, I haven't really been spending a whole lot of money. Um, so that's why I have been saving, but it's still like, like, I don't know. Like, it's like forcing me to save, which is amazing. Get your ears. All right, you guys, so now that I have my foundation blended all out, we're gonna go ahead and move on to concealer. And for concealer today, I'm gonna use my favorite concealer, which is the Too Faced Born This Way Concealer, and this is in the shade Toffee. If you guys would like to use me as like a shade reference or whatever. Oh my God, you guys. So if you guys have not seen yet, I did record a video last week where I did my makeup in the backyard the day before uh, the 4th of July. And honey, let me tell you, that video was one of the most stressful videos that I've ever made. When you're in the dark by yourself somewhere, it, you, just, you just hear things. I don't know, you just hear things that aren't there and like your mind plays tricks on you. I don't know what it is. And on top of that, fireworks just exploding all over me. Like, it was insane. So if you guys have not checked that video, please check it out. I'll probably leave it linked up here. You probably can just click on it. But um, that was a funny video. Like, that was super funny. Like, I highly recommend you guys go watch that. Um, now that we have our concealer blended out, everything's looking all nice and seamless. What I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna take, um, usually I would take like a lighter concealer to go in just to brighten up my highlighted areas. But since I don't know where my uh, Maybelline Fit Me concealer is, so we're just gonna go ahead and use this L'Oreal Infallible Foundation. It's super, guys, look how light this is. So it's gonna do the job. Um, it also has a really nice smell to it. Dab it on there. Hmm, it's all right. Now I know this looks insane right now. I know it looks insane, but we're gonna go ahead and blend it out and it's gonna all come together, I promise. You guys trust me, you trust me, right? You trust me, I know you trust me. I mean, if you're here, you trust me, right? <laughs> okay, let's stop. I can at least do that much, okay. Cool, let's go ahead and blend her out. Cool beans. All right, so now that that is blended out, we are looking, I, I don't know, I like this part of the makeup. I think it looks so cool, I'm like, <laughs> okay. 
Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows. I'm gonna take my um, CC Beauty 12 Color Flash Palette and use a black cream paint. You guys know that I'm obsessed with black eyebrows. All right, so now that we have that all done, we have all that blended out, we're gonna go ahead and set everything in place. I can't find my um, Cody Airspun powder, so we're gonna use this Maybelline powder, um, the Shine Free Maybelline Loose Powder. It looks like this. We're gonna use this to set our face. I pray that it doesn't give me flashback. I mean, I feel like if the Cody Airspun is gonna be flashback, this won't, but I mean, like, this doesn't say translucent, and I'm like, bitch. All right, you guys, here we go. All right, you guys, that is the base damn near done. I'm gonna go ahead and finish it up later on once I'm done with the eye makeup, but I'm gonna get off camera, do one eye off camera, and I'll be right back to show you guys exactly how I got the eye on the other eye. I don't know which one I'm gonna do first. Does that even matter? Anyway, all right, you guys, as you can see, I did one eye off camera. This is the eye we're gonna go ahead and bring you guys today. I hope you guys like it. I hope it looks cute enough for y'all. <laughs> Let's go ahead and jump up into it. Right, so the first shade I'm gonna go in with is a red shade from the James Charles palette, and we're gonna use this as our transition shade. So let's go ahead and stamp that on the eye. All right, so for the next color we're gonna go in with is a brown shade from the James Charles palette. It's like a dark, dark brown. We're gonna put that right under the red. Gonna just stamp it in here. We're now gonna go into an even darker brown shade. <laughs> um, you all know what my favorite word is. Let's sit together. One, two, three. A gradient. gradient mess okay so we're going with the dark brown shade we're gonna focus that deeper in the crease as you guys can see what I'm doing there the red on it we're gonna just blend together all right we're not gonna waste no time we're gonna go ahead and go into the shade spooky which is the black shade from the james charles palette we're really gonna just focus that right on top of that other one So now that that's done, we're gonna go ahead and cut the crease. I'm gonna use my Too Faced Born This Way concealer, and I'm gonna go in and start to carve out a half cut crease. I was like, what is going on? Like, why is this product coming out, y'all? I'll be getting sabotaged. My own products be sabotaging me, y'all. I'll be sitting here like, you just worked for the other eye. Like, why are you trying to give me a hard time now that I'm recording? Like, oh my God, scandalous. So we're gonna go into the James Charles palette. We're gonna take this really cute, like metallic blue shade to add, as a base, because we're gonna use blue glitter. But I like to go ahead with a base before I put the glitter on. So we're gonna take a blue shimmery shade and we're gonna use that as our base.
Hey guys, I don't know what happened here, but I lost the clip where I put the glitter on my eye, so I'll go ahead and leave that down in the description box. It's a blue glitter from Sin Cosmetics. For the next step, we're gonna go ahead and do some eyeliner. I'm gonna go ahead and take my, I always see I'm gonna go ahead and do, I'm gonna go ahead and, I'm gonna go ahead. Okay, so anyway, stop. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take my e.l.f. liquid liner and draw a snatch liner. Cool, now we're gonna take some red and blend some red all around the eyes. Cool, so now it's time for the lower lash line, which is like honestly my favorite part. I love doing the lower lash line because I feel like the lower lash line really just ties the whole eye look together. So um, let's go ahead and tackle that lower lash line. Now here's the tricky part. When you get to the corner here, you wanna angle it down. So you wanna literally just bring it, bring it down like that. So it looks way better when this front part is more sharp and precise. I'm gonna take some liner and we're gonna basically just draw on a line. Then we could take our smudger brush and smudge it. Let that dry down a bit and then we're gonna go in and we're gonna go ahead and add our white. We're gonna take the shade Spooky from the James Charles palette, which is a black, and we're gonna go ahead and fill in our brows. We're gonna take that same brush, wipe it off. <laughs> Guys, I know, I'm a mess. You can see this side is a little bit more pink. I like using pink right under the brow. I just think it really flatters the brow. I don't know. If you guys have made it this far in this video and you guys are not subscribed yet, please go ahead and subscribe to this channel because I would love to have you guys a part of the family. We are on our way to 400 subscribers, you guys, and it really warms my heart to see you guys clicking that subscribe button. Like, it means the world to me. So thank you so much. Uh, making YouTube videos is, like, literally the best thing that's ever happened to me, and I love doing it so freaking much. Like, even if the subscribers weren't there, I would still make videos because I love teaching. I love filming. I love lighting. I love all this. It's, like... I don't want to say it's an addiction because that's like that's like ODM, but like it's honestly something that like I can see myself doing for the rest of my life. Like it's amazing. So um, thank you so much for watching me, you guys. I can see it. Alright, you guys. So as you guys can see, both eyes are complete, and you guys know how I do here on this channel. The rest of this video from here on out is going to be a speed through. So sit back, relax, grab some popcorn, grab a drink, pop in some headphones, and let's go ahead and. Beat this mob. Let's go. Just a minute, till you 
Alright you guys, that is it for this video. I hope you guys loved it because I had so much fun creating this look for you guys today. This look is definitely outside of my comfort zone. Guys, do, how are you guys feeling about the faux freckles? Look at me. Sorry, I had to like zoom you guys in. Don't clock the lace. I'm sorry, she's coming up. But look at these freckles that I did. Do you guys like them? Um, to do the freckles, I use the what did I use? Oh, I use the Kat Von D um, Vampira liner, and girl, this shit has such a pointy tip. I mean, it's my first time doing faux freckles, so I hope they look good. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and zoom y'all out because I don't want y'all up in my business like that. Okay, anyway, um, if you guys like what you saw today, please go ahead and give this video a huge thumbs up because it helps me out a ton and it just lets me know that you like me. If you guys like me, please like me. Um, if you guys are not subscribed to this channel already, please go ahead and subscribe because I'm giving you guys videos every single week. That being said, I have some great, great news. I actually have an upload schedule now. <laughs> Um, I've been bringing you guys videos every single week, but my upload schedule has been horrific. I've literally just been like posting videos randomly instead of like saying, guys, I'm gonna give you guys a video this day at this time. So with that being said, I'm gonna be bringing you guys videos every single Friday at 12.30 p.m. Yes, girl, on your lunchtime. On your lunchtime, you guys, you can watch me on your lunchtime. You know what I mean? You can watch these videos on your lunch time. So there definitely will be a video every single Friday at 12.30. However, I may upload other videos throughout the week, meaning that you might get two videos a week, but you're definitely guaranteed a video every single Friday at 12.30, okay? That way you guys are just sitting there like, okay, is Venus gonna upload today? Is it tomorrow? Like, when is it? Like, no, you know exactly what I'm gonna upload. With that being said, you guys, I love you guys all so very much. If you guys are not subscribed to this channel yet, please go ahead and subscribe. And if you guys like this video, please give it a huge thumbs up. Um, and I love you guys all so very much. And since we're starting off this video on our new upload schedule, which is Friday at 1230, I want to go ahead and say cheers to the freaking weekend. This is a margarita and please do not drink if you are under the age of 21. Cheers, you guys. delicious. All right, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and get off of here and probably like take some pictures for Instagram and I'll see you guys next Friday. Bye.